so hello everyone welcome to my next video now in this video we'll be dealing with the main question that is asked in the university examination explain the mechanism of acid base balance by kidney now first point the kidneys form the third line of the kidneys form the third line of defense for acid base regulation of the body second point the ph of the body is maintained within a narrow, narrow range of 7.35 to 7.45 next point the hydrogen ion concentration in the body fluids is nearly 4 into 10 raised to power 5 mini equivalents per liter next point the kidney maintains the narrow ph range with the help of various buffers present in the tubule present in the renal tubule next point a buffer is defined as a weak acid and its salt with a strong base next point buffer plus hydrogen ion forms h buffer next point if hydrogen is added to the solution hydrogen ion is added to the solution the reaction moves in the rightward direction and the concentration of free hydrogen in decreases in the solution next point if there is decreased concentration of hydrogen in the solution the reaction shifts towards the left next point the kidney filters 4400 milli equivalents of hydrogen ion per day next point the kidney filters 4320 milli equivalents of bicarbonate ions per day next point the excess of 80 around 80 milli equivalents of hydrogen ion in the range of 50 to 100 milli equivalents are produced as a result of addition of fixed acids that is non volatile acids formed in the body by the metabolism of sulfur containing amino acids and phosphorus containing amino acids which result in the formation of phosphoric acid and sulfuric acid next point these fixed acids also react with the interstitial buffer bicarbonate buffer present in the interstitial fluids and result in formation of result in loss of bicarbonate from the body in the form of carbon dioxide in the form of carbon dioxide next point the kidney maintains acid base balance mainly by three mechanisms number 1 by secretion of hydrogen number 2 by reabsorption of filtered bicarbonate number 3 by generation of new bicarbonate next point first mechanism secretion of 
hydrogen ion by the kidney now question is asked here explain the secretion of hydrogen ion by the kidney in different segments of the tubule or the secretion of how the secretion of hydrogen ion by the kidney differs in the early part of distal tubule and late part of distal tubule short note next or how the secretion of hydrogen ion differs in the proximal convoluted tubule and the collecting ducts or and the collecting ducts first secretion of hydrogen a point in proximal convoluted tubule thick ascending limb and early part of distal tubule now this is the interstitium this is the lumen and this is the tubular epithelial cell first point carbon dioxide plus water in the cell react in the presence of carbonic anhydrase enzyme carbonic anhydrase enzyme increases the speed of the reaction second point forming carbonic acid third point the carbonic acid dissociates into hydrogen ions and bicarbonate ions next point sodium potassium atps pump is present on the basolateral membrane of the tubular epithelial cell next point the hydrogen so formed is secreted into the lumen of the tubule by sodium hydrogen counter transport as sodium moves along the concentration gradient and hydrogen moves against the concentration gradient it is a form of secondary active transport the bicarbonate so formed is reabsorbed into the interstitium by sodium bicarbonate co transporter next point the filtered bicarbonate the filtered bicarbonate in the lumen reacts with the secreted hydrogen to form carbonic acid this carbonic acid again dissociates into carbon dioxide and water the carbon dioxide so forms diffuses in intracellularly next point for each hydrogen that is secreted for each hydrogen secreted one bicarbonate is reabsorbed a new bicarbonate is formed inside the cell the one that is filtered is not directly reabsorbed next this is the process by which 4320 milli equivalents of hydrogen are titrated against 4320 milli equivalents of bicarbonate in the renal tubule next mechanism of secretion of hydrogen in the late part of distal tubule and collecting ducts
कार्बन टैक्स फर्स्ट पॉइंट कार्बन डाइऑक्साइड प्लस वाटर रिएक्ट इनसाइड द सेल इन द प्रेंस ऑफ एंजाइम कार्बोनिक एंड हाइड्रेस टू फॉर्म कार्बोनिक एसिड द रिएक्शन अकर्स देर इज नेक्स्ट पॉइंट देर इज प्रेजेंस ऑफ स्पेशलाइज इंटरकलेटेड सेल्स इन द लेट पार्ट ऑफ डिस्टल टिब्यूल एंड द कलेक्टिंग डक्ट दीज सेल्स आर मेनली रिस्पॉन्सिबल फॉर सिक्रीशन ऑफ हाइड्रोजन एंड मेंटेनेंस ऑफ एसिड बेस बैलेंस इन द बॉडी नेक्स्ट पॉइंट द कार्बोनिक एसिड सो फॉर्म डिसोशिएट्स इन टू हाइड्रोजन आयन्स एंड बाइकार्बोनेट आयन्स द हाइड्रोजन सो फॉर्म्ड इज सिक्रीटेड इन टू द ल्यूमन ऑफ द टिब्यूल इन टू द ल्यूमन ऑफ द टिब्यूल बाय द प्रेजेंस ऑफ हाइड्रोजन ए टी पी एस पम्प ऑन द अपाइकल मेम्ब्रेन इट इज अ फॉर्म ऑफ प्राइमरी एक्टिव ट्रांसपोर्ट next point the bicarbonate so formed is reabsorbed by bicarbonate chloride exchanger next point tabulate the differences between the mechanism of secretion of hydrogen in the early part of distal tubule and late part of distal tubule first point hydrogen is secreted by sodium hydrogen counter transport transporter present on apical membrane it is a form of secondary active transport here it is secreted by hydrogen atps pump and hydrogen potassium atps pump two pumps are present next it is a form of primary active transport next point third point the secretion of hydrogen is sodium dependent here the secretion of hydrogen is sodium independent next point the hydrogen that is secreted is 4 to 5 fold however the hydrogen here that is secreted is around 900 fold hydrogen can be secreted into the lumen next point it decreases the ph of the lumen up to 6.7 only here it decreases the ph of the lumen to 4.5 this ph of 4.5 is called the limiting ph limiting ph means it is the ph at which no more hydrogen ion can be secreted into the lumen but since hydrogen immediately combines with the ba- with a buffer such as bicarbonate in this case and other buffers will be told later and other buffers such as ammonia buffer in the late part of distal tubule it will combine so free hydrogens are not left in the lumen as a result the ph of limiting ph of 4.5 is not reached immediately and more and more hydrogen can be secreted so now we come to the next part reabsorption of bicarbonate that was the next main